Saley puts a shot on to back door and Saley taps it home. Cola Saley on the two on one. You know, being a great teammate is, uh, it's not only uh, something you do on the ice, it's its something you do off the ice, you know, showing up to the rink with a smile on your face, showing up, uh, you know, happy and, and welcoming to the guys, uh, you know, asking if if things uh, kind of seem off, um, you know, everyone's struggling, everyone uh, has uh, problems at home and all that, and I think just kind of coming in with open arms and uh, helping out all the guys in the room, um, you know, some guys might not always want to go to a parent or an adult, you know, coming to you. To one of the boys, one of your brothers is always a uh, you know a better uh, better out for sure. And I think on the ice, ice is uh, you know just putting your uh, setting your teammates up for success. You know, uh, giving them that right pass so they don't get you know blown up for a suicide hit or uh, setting them up uh, with some nice passes for breakaways and all that kind of stuff. You know, I think all that comes. But uh, being a teammate off the ice is a lot more important. Um, you know, around the community as well, just being a good leader uh, in the billet families. Um, you know, when you're going into restaurants and just always having. Uh, that mindset that you're representing the logo, um, and I think that's huge. Um, what goes into the mindset of being a good teammate is, uh, you know, just having that ability to to want to come to the rink and battle every day. Having that mindset that, you know, today you're going to want to compete and make the guys next to you better. Um, that's a good th big thing that we touched on all year with coaches, and you know, there's a time to, time and place to have fun, and there's a time to place to work. And I think we have a good uh, culture in the room where we do have a lot of fun, and there's a time and place where we work. So I think that mindset of just fluctuating between the two is is kind of what you need for a good teammate. Um, you know, it's very important to be a great teammate. Um, you know, there's 25 guys or so in a room, and uh, I think if one of those guys is, you know, he doesn't have the, the best mindset or he's, he's not the happiest guy in the room, it kind of brings the whole mood down. So I think uh, just kind of everyone being that, that teammate, having a smile on their face is obviously going to help, and I, I couldn't do it without the guys. You know, the guys come in, they're always, they always have smiles on their face, so kudos to those guys, and, you know, I just try to, try to follow them. And uh... Super inclusive and very unselfish towards everybody. Uh, some examples would be just he never says no to anybody. For example, driving people to work out or out to lunch and stuff like that. He's always willing to do stuff for other people. Yeah, being nominated for this award is huge. Obviously, coming in as a, as a new guy coming from BC for the past two years, I didn't know what it was going to be like. Um, I kind of brought, got brought in with uh, welcoming arms from the coaches, the staff, Serge, McFeeters, all those guys. So. Um, you know, I just tried to be me. Um, I was always brought up, you know, you're a person before you're a hockey player, and that was huge. And I, uh, I just tried to be that person that I that I was brought up to be by my parents. And um, yeah, just coming with that smile on my face, like I said earlier. And uh, yeah, it's it's obviously an honor for sure. And uh, I'm I'm not gonna kind of let it down. I'm gonna keep trying to do what I'm doing and just maintain this teammate.